for the very first time, our cameras were given total access to the highly secretive Northwest Regional Emmy Production Facility to show you how each and every Emmy is made. It all begins here in one of 14 Northwest Regional Emmy Production Facilities. Its location is kept confidential to protect its highly complex Emmy creation secrets. Unlike any other Emmy, the Northwest Regional Emmy is distinctive in its construction. It begins with a life-size model, then a master sketch artist creates a rendering. Google Images is sometimes used too for comparison purposes. The first step in fabricating the Emmy mold is one of the most dangerous. A secretive and highly toxic combination of chemicals is used to create the Emmy's wings. The hazardous compound is delicately poured into a rotocaster. This gyrating motion keeps the volatile chemicals from settling. If they do, it would create an explosion devastating 10 square miles, like it did in 1966. Nearly 100 gallons of deadly toxic chemicals and acids are used for each Northwest Regional Emmy. And all of it must be delicately disposed of immediately after use. Next, a torso is created 10 times human size. After the design is thoroughly inspected, it's put through the grinder and discarded here in the Northwest Regional Emmy's very own landfill. A scale model of the Emmy is crafted from platinum, and until the final paint and seal, it's extremely poisonous to the touch, in part because of its not as produced uranium core. Skilled craftsmen from the work release program handle each and every Emmy as it gets ever closer to your mantle. That gorgeous gold plating? You'll be happy to know it is indeed gold. Purchased direct from a controversial and yet extremely affordable gold mine in Uganda. That's some old growth timber, spawning new life thanks to the Emmys. The Northwest Regional Emmys seized nearly 30,000 acres of old growth forest, which it uses to make the containers that the Emmys are shipped in. This Northwest Regional Emmy owned cargo ship is loaded with Emmys headed for Hong Kong, because that's where the exclusive lead based paint is applied by inmates at this maximum security prison. After a final buff and fire seal, the winner's names are engraved and the Emmys ready for award night. Assuming it passes final weight inspections. So congratulations Northwest Regional Emmy winners and hang on tight. It's truly a prized possession.